But first at six and only on CBS 46, highway headaches, signage missing or misplaced on a busy Atlanta interstate. Drivers arguing it's already adding to dangerous road conditions. We're talking about I-285 near Georgia 400. Drivers say the exits on this section of the perimeter are putting lives at risk. CBS 46's Zach Summers live in the road tracker tonight after talking to drivers and Georgia DOT. Zach. Yeah, you know, hundreds of thousands of drivers travel this stretch of I-285 near Georgia 400 every day, but for some, including myself, choosing the right exit can be daunting and sometimes dangerous. In fact, this very interchange is now the subject of a viral video posted on TikTok this week. It's a madhouse. Charles Goldberg has lived near the perimeter in Dunwoody for more than 20 years. But there's one stretch of I-285 that drives him crazy. Traffic is just incredibly dangerous, frustrating. You see a lot of road rage and you see a lot of accidents happening. The area near Georgia 400 has been under construction for several years, but Goldberg believes the signage in place, specifically on westbound 285 approaching 400, is confusing drivers. The signs don't fully describe what each exit is and where the exits are. In addition, the signs are misplaced. Goldberg says drivers wanting to get off on Roswell Road or 400 North or South often have to make split second decisions, which can be dangerous and add time to commute. There was no sign to indicate to the drivers which side of the road to take. We're so glad that you came to us with these. CBS 46 took Goldberg's concerns to GDOT. Spokeswoman Natalie Dale says their project team is now in talks with the contractor on the project to potentially make changes. We have already asked them, uh, based on one of your requests, to put that just to indicate Roswell Road specifically. She says the 285-400 interchange project is complex, that there's a lot of moving parts and drivers will see bigger shifts in the next four to six weeks. It may never be perfect in the construction zone, but we certainly want to address specific confusions um, if, if we're hearing it um, sort of in mass. And back out here live looking toward Roswell Road. You know, the big question is when will this project be completed? Well, GDOT says the contract finish date is 2023, but that drivers could see substantial completion by the end of the year. We're live in the Cool Ray Road Tracker near 285 and 400. Zach Summers, CBS 46 News. Thank you, Zach. New to